Hello, everyone. In this video, we will learn how to establish a bidirectional relationship between a main form and a subform. Before we move on with the configuration, let's understand what a bidirectional relationship is. A bidirectional relationship is a lookup type in Creator where data flow is mutual between the related forms. Let's assume there are two forms, form A and form B. If these two forms are connected bidirectionally, the data entered on form A can be accessed and modified on form B. As a result, any changes made to a record in form B will automatically update the related record in form A. Here, we will look at establishing a bidirectional relationship between the main form and a subform. Let's consider the example of an order processing app. The screen you see now is the order form to receive customer orders. We have another form, line items, to choose the products with varying quantities. The line items form is used as the subform in the order form. The subform field name is items. Let's create a bidirectional relationship between the order form and the line items form. To do that, from the line items form, open the editor, access the form builder, and add a lookup field from the advanced field section. Select our main form, the order form, and choose the relevant filter link. In our case, let's choose the name field. Creator automatically detects if a relationship already exists between these forms. In that case, you will see an alert box with the option to enable the bidirectional connection. Let's enable the relationship. Once you do that, Creator will display the list of existing relations in the main form. Since line items is already a subform in the order form, the subform field name items is listed here. Select the existing relation, choose the required display format and click Done. This lookup field uses the current relation items and bidirectionally syncs data with the order form by mapping its record ID. Let's hide this field from the users by choosing the admin only option from the visibility section, as this will be inappropriate for the users. Click Done. Let's see how this bidirectional relation between two forms works in real time. Let's place an order through the order form. The details of the product and its quantity order will be stored in the line items report by default, as it is a subform in the order form. We have configured a bidirectional relationship. Modifying the data in the line items report will automatically update the record in the all orders report. Additionally, the order form fields can also be viewed on the line items report. This would help the store owners keep a record of the products purchased by each customer. This is just one instance where a bidirectional relationship can be beneficial. Based on your requirements, you can establish such relationships to seamlessly synchronize and access data between multiple forms in Zoho Creator. That's all for this video. Subscribe to our YouTube channel to learn more about Zoho Creator and press the bell icon to get notified whenever a new video releases. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.